This week, I chose Camino Island by John Grisham. And I read it. Let's get into the review. Camino Island is about a couple of robbers who go to Princeton and steal some manuscripts that Fitzgerald wrote for some of his books, including Great Gatsby. You follow the track of these manuscripts in a way, and each chapter uh, diverges from one character to another. The rest of the book is about trying to recover those manuscripts, and you have a bunch of characters that are entwined in this process. You have FBI characters, you have writers, uh, and it also all revolves around a bookstore that is in Camino Island. The plot was pretty engaging throughout the entire story, but the problem was is that you have these characters which I considered to be pretty bland, and then you have this writing style that's kind of like just... It's just very simplistic. The writing style isn't really different from anything you've seen before. It's just a simple narrative. But what carries this book is that the story itself is interesting. The uh, heist part of the book is just the best. I think it's the most exciting. And you're following the storyline, but then it just seems like every single step is so predictable and expected and almost like it's just too perfect. Like, Some aspects of the book were seemed very like legitimate and grounded. The characters sometimes interacted in realistic ways, but other times the characters did not speak to each other in ways that any characters ever would. The dialogue sometimes was unrealistic. You know, it keeps your interest, it's easy to read, but I just don't think that that's what defines a good book. This book actually kind of turns into a discussion and kind of a reflection of writing as a whole. Like there's a bunch of dialogue and conversation about the state of book writing and it's mostly like authors dogging on each other and that's like an interesting part of it. I found it relatively enjoyable. I just didn't feel like I had gained anything from reading this. It felt more just like something to like pass the time which I was not impressed with. From that I would say that I would give this book a 2.75 and I would say that's being a bit lenient. So if I was to rate this book I am going to give it a 3.25 out of 5 because it's good, it's entertaining, but it's not like brilliant or anything. It's just good and entertaining. There was a lot of like unnecessary parts of this book that he threw in to have some more kind of falsified complexity to it and I think that it just wasn't it wasn't well integrated into the plotline. I think this is a great quick read if you get your hands on it, but don't expect anything miraculous. It's just a good book. So go check out Camino Island. Maybe. <laughs> we'll see what you think.